Hey guys, I'm excited. Welcome to my channel. I got this uh, pine log I cut up into a nice square chunk. You guys want to see that video? I'll be putting it out soon. Just got this out of the forest and I'm going to be... This is my cutting log. I wanted to make one so when I sharpen my blades, I have something to cut on. So I went out, got one, so cut it in the forest. And so I'm going to make my own rig. Let's uh, put it together. So I've got these two here, two pallets. So I'm just going to lean them over in my good stance and get them somewhat. Get them leaning good and a little bit even. I'm just going to use some pieces of two by six, put them on, and then uh, I will uh, cut off the ends. Let's uh, get a drill bit there. And I've got my screws. So basically, I'm going to set it up and I'll cut these off at the end. Or I'll leave them. I don't know. But I want it flush because I'm going to put another one over here to get it as close as possible. It's pretty wet through, so just got to get through in here. Get it pretty preset. And drill through. I always wanted one of these. You kind of sharpen your chainsaw and you wonder if it's sharp. So I wanted a cutting block. Once you get started, it's a little bit easier. It's just my stance. So once you get it started, it's a little easier. These guys right click me. Good. And I'll lift this up a little bit. There. I don't have to be perfect, but close. I might be leaning a little bit, but that's all right. Pull here. Just a little bit, but that's all right. Not a little bit. Just enough to hold the pine log there. This one in would be a lot easier to... So, there's that one. So I got to do pretty much the same thing on this other side. Put one here, but for now, let's see. All right, so I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. So I'm going to turn around. And we're going to do the same thing on this side. So I can keep it flat here. Hi, Rosie. Hi, girl. Hi. What you do? That's my dog, Rosie. You'll see videos with her, too. Watch out. He likes to go out with me. Collecting firewood. Drill a hole here. Screw in. Rosie, stay off. Leave it. Good girl. That was a little bit easier than that. I wanted it for platform, so when I put one across here, you'll see. Another screw in here. I'm just pre-drill them so they don't. Doesn't crack the wood. Helps out a lot. One in. And they didn't a little bit more in. There we go. That's good. So now I've got my stance. So now it's it's good. You can see here. So I got that set up. Pretty sturdy. Possibly put one on the bottom here a little bit. We got here in the middle. And this pine is gonna stick off a little bit. So put it there. So we'll do the leaves. And I'll be screwing them into these off here. And I'm using three inch screws here. Alright, got those. Another one. There, so now it's pretty sturdy. I'll most likely be to put one on the top and bottom of the A-frame. But that's pretty much what I was looking for. So I'll take and rip these off. And I might just leave it in this little platform. But here's my idea. So with this piece of pine here, it'll be sitting there like that. But obviously it's going to be, eventually it's going to be hanging off way over here. But for now, I can strap it down because I'm only going to be cutting pieces off there half inch just enough and then I take a work it over so it looks like that's gonna hold just right so I'm gonna screw that down you guys can see it now be perfect can wait to test it out so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna just put a screw in here pre-drill it both sides on you screw into these ones here and I'll do the same thing on the back half this will just keep the log from moving around and I'll use my three inch put four screws in that's why I like using the hex ones instead of Phillips. Back it out a little bit. I'm just gonna use a new one. Probably got the wrong tip on it. If it doesn't sit in there just right, see how it rolls around? It's actually the wrong Phillips tip. It should be nice and snug. It shouldn't rock at all, but it'll work. Gotta push a little bit. There we go. And on this side, run it back out. Holds good. Look at that. Nice and sturdy. It's a little leaning this way, but I got a sandbag. It all just catch on this other side if I have an issue. But I'm not gonna be pushing hard. Got one more to put in. There we go. Nice and solid, but it holds. So then I can cut on it. So we'll test it out. All right, so let's test this sucker out. I'm using my 500i. I haven't sharpened it, but when I do sharpen it, I wanna see how it works, so. Yeah, yeah that's sturdy enough for now.
little bit of sturdiness I want to put to it. But uh, a couple sandbags hanging down below it. But there's my uh, homemade uh, log chainsaw tester, as you can call it. But nice little pieces. Nice, nice little setup. This is the jig I wanted to make, and now I got it. Thanks for watching, and look for the video. I'll show you um, the video on um, how I got this piece. I appreciate you guys watching. Stay tuned, subscribe. Please leave comments for uh, the algorithm. Helps me out. Appreciate it. Have a good night.